Dr. Matthew Grunkemeyer with Commonwealth Orthopedic Centers. Thank you for uh, joining us today to learn a little bit about uh, meniscus tears. What are they? Um, how can you treat them through rehab or through surgery? Uh, and why do they cause so much pain in the knee joint? Uh, this is a model I've, I've got today of the knee joint. This shows the patella uh, tendon coming down. And as you, if you look on the inside of the knee joint and open it up, I see, you see these two disc-shaped uh, cartilage uh, components of the joint. They sort of serve as shock absorbers and they help the round femur bone sit on top of the flat tibia bone. Um, they serve a purpose in the normal knee of uh, uh, removing the, the forces of the knee, when, especially when twisting or pivoting. However, they can tear, and when they tear, they hurt. They're filled with nerve fibers, um, and they generally tear here in the back part uh, of the knee joint. Uh, this is the lateral meniscus and the medial meniscus um, cartilage. Uh, any type of twist or pivot, uh, a deep squat, uh, can cause these to tear. Uh, when they tear, if they're very small, uh, they can be treated with uh, physical therapy and activity limitations. If they propagate or become larger or start causing mechanical symptoms within the knee, such as clicking, catching, popping, or locking, uh, then they're probably best treated with surgery. Uh, the surgery uh, is of two types. Uh, the first type uh, is a meniscal repair. That's where we actually suture uh, the meniscus cartilage back down uh, to the joint capsule. Uh, that is generally done in conjunction with an ACL uh, surgery or in a very young patient where there's better uh, um, ability for healing. Uh, if that type of surgery is not able to be done, then what is done is called a partial meniscectomy. Uh, that is where a very small part of the meniscus cartilage where it is torn will be removed uh, and the rest of the remaining healthy meniscus tissue will be left behind since, as I explained earlier, it does have a normal function. Uh, this is successful with pain relief and in conjunction with physical therapy can restore your knee back to a normal or near normal healthy uh, range of motion and ability uh, to perform the exercises and the other things uh, that everyone enjoys doing with their knees. Thank you for your time and attention.